think the, the best term is persistence because I don't care if you're you know, the best wrestler in the world or you're, you're someone that's just trying to accomplish a goal. I think you're always going to have failures. And if you let the failures outweigh you know, you, your successes, you're going to always be hindering yourself to get to that next level. So being persistent and obsessed is, is definitely something that uh, you know, the better guys are able to do and, and, and get to that level. So there's a lot more that goes into it. They hang out for the whole summer and not really wrestle. Now the kids are just, you know, find themselves on the mat three to four times a week all year round. Um, in order to sustain a mental status of, of being able to compete well, it's going to be getting up for each match and um, embracing the grind. Now, really, you know, when it comes down to wanting to accomplish anything, it's a lifestyle, right? Because if you're not, um, you know, doing it every day, you're not thinking about it, you're not really on the, you know, the same trail as someone else that is. And, you know, putting, putting the time in um, on the mat and as well as, you know, the off. He has a really good uh, outlook on fighting is just, you know, being obsessed with it and, and not really focusing on your failures is just, you know, being able to continuously grind through it, embrace it, and uh, you'll come out on top. You have a little bit of success and I think it just snowballed into what he's got now.